and welcome to this tutorial on how to add a follower grid to your stream. What is the follower grid? Well this grid fetches the last 100 followers that you have. Anyone in that 100 with a profile picture will be rotated into this grid. Integrating the follower grid for your stream is really simple and I'll show you how to do this right now. Before we start you will need to have the CLR browser plugin for OBS installed. If you don't have this installed, please see the description box for the download links. First of all, open your browser and visit twitchgrid.com. When you get to this page, um, click login with Twitch. And this will ask you if you want to authorize it. So we'll authorize here. And this will redirect you to the dashboard. Now it automatically fetches all of your followers for the preview below. Okay, step one, choose your stream resolution. Uh, the most common aspect ratios for streaming are both these below here. If you've got anything less than 1080 by 720, um, just use this option. You can find your resolution in the video settings in OBS. So we'll just tab back here, go to settings, and video and here you see I used 1920 by 1080 so we'll select this okay step two select your animation and theme theme is split into two parts default and light uh, the default is nice for quick integration it provides an ideal background without being too distracting um, then the light theme Contains no styling, so you're free to change the transparency in OBS or overlay different color backgrounds onto it. Right now, we're just going to use the default. The animations are self explanatory. Uh, the default setting is random, so you can see here it'll alternate between a wide range of animations. Uh, you can cycle through these and preview below. So rotate 3D, we'll start rotating. And for now, we're going to do the simple fade in and out. Once you're happy with the result, you're now ready to generate the URL. So just click that button there. And here you have your hosted URL. So to note as well, note the width and the height. So 1920 by 1080. We'll copy this. Tab back. And on the scene, what we'll do is we'll add a browser source. Call this Twitch Grid. And we'll paste in the URL. And as well, the width and the height and okay that and there you have it the whole grid is there and it's loaded on we'll uh, move this up and if you like as well you can stretch the boxes out there and there you have it that's how you add a twitch grid to your stream if you found this video helpful please like and subscribe thank you mm -hmm.